Welcome back to Classic Gaming Quarterly TV. When you're sliding into first and you feel something burst, it can only mean one thing. You've got explosive diarrhea for the Atari 2600. Explosive Diarrhea is a 2014 release for the Atari 2600 from Packrat Video Games, designed and programmed by Chris Reed. The game is available for order at packratvg.com and costs a paltry $20, including shipping. The game is not a limited release of any kind, so only an idiot would buy this game at a higher price on eBay. Contrary to what you might think, Explosive Diarrhea is not a sequel to 1984's Montezuma's Revenge. According to the manual, the setup for the game is this. The redneck family ate some bad clams at a family reunion and the subsequent gastrointestinal distress has them all racing to the bathroom. Do rednecks eat clams? I would think they would have been made sick by eating tainted barbecue or something. Anyway, an unfortunately placed minefield separates them from the only outhouse at their disposal. After each redneck makes it to the john, the minefield re-randomizes so that the next person can't simply follow the same path. The basic gameplay idea is simple. As you guide your character across the minefield, unless you get really lucky, you're gonna die. Remember where you got killed and the exact path you took to get there so that you can avoid that mine on the next try. Repeat the process until you get your rednecks safely to their side. Do this as quickly as you can to get as many rednecks across the minefield as possible in only 60 seconds. Playing this game, I can't help but think back to Atari games like Chase the Chuck Wagon and Tooth Protectors, and wonder if Packrat didn't miss out on an opportunity here. Both Chuck Wagon and Tooth Protectors were promotional games released by Purina and Johnson & Johnson, respectively. Maybe Packrat should have approached Imodium AD or Pepto-Bismol before rushing this game to market. Can you imagine this game being released with a Pepto-Pink shell? It might be a bad idea to play this game if you yourself actually have explosive diarrhea, as that may be akin to someone who can't relieve their need to pee really badly hearing the sound of running water. Explosive Diarrhea is definitely a fun game and an interesting conversation piece. Slip this one into your collection the next time you have a friend over for game night, then let him pick the game. If he doesn't pick this one, you need a new friend. You want me to read all of these? Yeah, just go through all of them and we'll go with whatever sounds the funniest. I don't have to sing them though, right? No, no, just say them in your normal voice. Alright. Some people think it's funny, but it's really wet and runny. When you're sliding into third and you feel a... Oh, come on. That's just sickening. When you're sliding into home and your pants are full of foam? That doesn't even make sense. Who shits foam? I cracked foam one time. Oh, you have? Yeah. What'd you eat? <laughs> 